I was just wandering this area and just trying to explore the entire village and this village is really beautiful it's more than what I expected just hearing the sounds of the birds and a beautiful waterfall behind me it's one of those picture perfect moments here I am talking about Cornwall village but to get here we will have to go back the day before where this all started It's around 10:40, uh, and uh, we have just started our trek and heading towards Ahupe. So today we would be doing a trek from Ahupe to Bhima Shankar. For this we boarded an HT bus from Kalyan, which was heading towards Murbad. And from Murbad we then took a private jeep, which costed us around 500 rupees to drop us at Khopuvli. So now we have taken a guide. So. We have a halt in the night, that's yet not decided, let's see where we will have the halt, it all depends on the space in which we walk, so hopefully you like this vlog which is going to come up. around uh, 2 o'clock so it took us around 3 hours to reach here we left the base at around 10.40 uh, I guess so little more than 3 hours to reach here uh, so till now the trek was little bit of try tiring because it has not rained today uh, but the views from here are quite good you can see I don't know whether you can see but uh, the view is quite good so most probably we will be having a lunch here and then heading towards uh, Bhima Shankar so we would be uh, halting for the night at one of the villages before Bhima Shankar 3-4 hours before Bhima Shankar and then let's see how it all goes it's around 6 10 right now so we have reached Kondwal village so we would be staying here for the night and then again resuming a trek for Bhima Shankar tomorrow morning so it's a beautiful little village uh, that comes between Ahupe and uh, Bhima Shankar so it's just before Bhima Shankar it's surrounded by uh, mountains all over and it's quite a beautiful place
I was just wandering this area and just trying to explore the entire village and this village is really beautiful it's more than what I expected uh, I'm like sitting here alone uh, just hearing the sounds of the birds and a beautiful waterfall behind me it's one of those picture perfect moments uh, so this, this village is damn beautiful actually one should stay here overnight I say uh, but for that, I don't know, our guide had known someone here, so that's how we got to stay here. But he, he claims that there is a mandir and a school as well, so you could be trying staying there if you're coming on your own, or if your guide doesn't know anyone in the area. So, yeah, you should visit this place, it's called Kondwal village and it's just before Bhima Shankar, on the way to Bhima Shankar in fact, and quite a great place as compared to Bhima Shankar where you'll get lots of crowd here you'll not find anyone on this uh, route Day 2 had started with a bang, with we visiting these waterfalls just after Khondwal village. The rest of the trek till Bhima Shankar was an easy walk, with occasional ascents. It took us around 2.5 hours to reach Bhima Shankar. It's around uh, 12 o'clock right now, so we had our snacks over here, visited the mandir. And now we are going to start our descent from here. So it should take us roughly around three hours to reach uh, the base village. So we are descending via Ganesh Ghat. So it's a much longer route as compared to CD Ghat. So yeah, the weather is good here, but then there's too much of crowd at Bhima Shankar. So yeah, let's see. Uh, it's around uh, 3.30 and uh, we are almost approaching Khandes. So overall it was a very good trek and good endurance level is required. The trek was fun. So hope you like the en entire vlog uh, of this trek. I hope you to Bhima Shankar to like, subscribe and comment.